This is Expedition Unknown. Hunt for the Yeti. We kick off the premiere of Expedition Unknown, Hunt for the Yeti, which is a four-part Expedition Unknown series. Of all of the mystery creatures out in the world, I think the Yeti is the one that I most want to exist. It follows Josh Gates, who's the ultimate adventurer and fabulous storyteller. And every story that we do on Expedition Unknown is really tied into Josh's personal passion. So the fact that Josh has been fascinated with the Yeti and is it real and if so, where can I find him and meeting the people who claim to have first-hand accounts of seeing the Yeti is something that we just knew we needed to blow out in a big way. See the trees moving, right there, right there, right there. We wanted to create a, a you know, a big standing kind of heroic, uh, you know, statue of the, uh, the Yeti. Um, and, uh, you know, figure out the most um, kind of stable and dynamic pose we can give. So it took us uh, you know, a whole day to just kind of get all the pieces together. And then we disassemble it in our studio, you know, and wrap them up to, to uh, bring it here to rebuild it today. Personality of a Yeti, you know, they're, they, they typically are very shy people, but uh, as, as the tradition kind of goes, they, they tend to show themselves to those that believe in them. And then and that's why we were able to come here to New York because it is, the city of believing, I think, you know, and, and so everybody's here taking pictures of them and that's what really brings out the positive uh, characteristics and, and traits of a Yeti is when they are around people that believe and are just happy to see them. What was that again? <laughs> he loved the bagels and the pizza. What's exciting about this is, and you can see it here today, it's a story that everybody in the household can watch. We've had little kids who recognize the Yeti who's taking pictures and I think that New Yorkers are um, kind of a skeptical bunch and the fact that we can really play with the legend of Yeti and is it real or is it not and what a showcase for something that's so um, such a visual spectacle and we also wanted a lot of people on the street to just react and stop and take pictures and just create some noise and what better place on earth to do that. Let's go find a Yeti.